Um, you've got a new uh, product that you're talking about the, that you're going to ageless and do okay, so ageless yes. and healthy. So I'm 45. Most women will never admit that, especially on TV. But I'm 45, and you look good for 45. Thank you, Botox. Yeah. Filler, you look good for 45. Yeah. So thank you very much. Women don't talk about the stuff that they do. Oh, it's natural. No, it's not natural. It's naturally like yes, it's hyaluronic acid, which is natural. That's fillers in my face. Botox is natural, uh -huh. <laughs> it's, but it's a toxin. So people Getting use the real this, juice today, right? huh? I'm like I don't even know what she's talking about. Ironic <laughs> fill, what? Yeah. So it's everything that women do that they don't talk about, you uh -huh. know. So I'm extremely healthy. I was a vegan for 24 years. I'm a vegetarian now, but I also do things that keep me looking young. So I have um, a new platform. It's called Ageless and Healthy, mm -hmm. and it's how to look younger, how to feel better, how to have more energy. Energy. And it's with, you know, like it goes anywhere, it runs the gamut from creams to machines. That's what I say. So mm -hmm. anything from lasers, I talk about everything I've ever done to myself. I am, I, I, no hold, no, like no holds barred. I am completely open about it. Where I see so many women are embarrassed to talk about it. Right. It's like, you know, you get your hair dyed and you don't pretend that, you know, you know, you don't lie about it. No, my hair isn't white. I don't have any grays. No, that's all natural, you know? <laughs> but so women don't, and I've, I've kind of opened up that forum and it's really interesting talking to women about that and like um, having them open up and, and talk about it. And it's fine. Over over in England, it's like nobody has a problem with it. Yeah. But here, everybody's like, shh, right. don't say anything. Yeah. I'm embarrassed of it. So I just started talking about it and, and adding all everything I've done with health over the years and uh, and it's been really fun and that's my passion project right. I'm still doing my syndicated you know mortgage radio show uh -huh. I still have a law show here on KBC I'm still doing that that pays the bills this is I just started it so I'm I love it I love what I do 